Hi guys, in this video, we'll look at how we can merge two sorted linked list into a single one. So given two sorted linked list, merge them into one linked list such that all the elements of the new list are sorted. So uh, our examples are straightforward, self-explanatory. Uh, list one is 13810, list two is 1456. So our merged list is uh, 11345687. Our second example is Again, 10, 20, 30 is list one, one, two, three is list two. So our merged list is one, two, three, 10, 20, 30. So straightforward uh, problem description, and I'm sure the solution is also straightforward. The code is pretty easy, so we should uh, cruise through it. So let's go to the whiteboard. Uh, let's see the approach and then come back and run the code. Okay, so let's see how we'll solve this uh, merge two sorted list problem. So these are the two sample lists that we took it from problem description and this is the formula or the code or the algorithm that will follow. So what we are going to do is we are going to do a while loop till either of the list or like till both of the list are null. So keep looping and finish looping when both the lists are done. So what we are doing is we are taking a dummy node or we are taking a node. Uh, so let's say this is our node and it's a dummy node. So it points to zero. Let's say for now and then uh, what we do is we this is this would be our return list or this will be our thing that will be returned into as a merge list so we'll keep pointing to these elements such that we get one list which is sorted so what we do is uh, if l2 is equal to null or l1 is not equal to null and l1's value is less than l2 value less than or equal to then we say okay node point to l1 and then l1 move to next node and else node point to l2 and L2 move on to next node. So let's see how that does. So we'll compare, uh, so both are not null, so we'll compare value of both the nodes. So since they are equal, L1 value is less than equal to L2 value, one, one, we'll say node dot next is equal to L1. So this will point to here. And then L1 will move to next node. So what will happen to L1? L1 will go here. Okay, so this is done. Now we come again. L2 is null, no. L1 is not null, yes. L1 value is less than L2 value, one is less than three, no. So we'll go into else part. So node dot next is L2. So next would be L2. So here and L2 move to next. So L2 would be here. So yeah. So our list is now zero, one, one. And same thing, uh, L1 value is less than L2 value. So three is less than four, yes. So node will point to L1 and L1 move to next. So this will now point to, uh, L1 should have been here, sorry. Yeah, so now this will point to this guy. And we'll go again and then now we'll compare, L1 will obviously move here. Now we'll compare L1 value with L2 value, which is eight and four, four is less, so we'll do here. So this will point here and L2 will move to here. And eventually when we keep doing this, they both will be null and we'll get our sorted list like this. So this will be this and then this, no, sorry. So this will be like this and then this and then this and done. So our merge list would be one, one, three, four, five, six, eight, ten. So uh, there you go. Pretty straightforward, uh, just simple loop, and then we have one merge list. So uh, let's look at actual code. Let's look at this uh, dummy node and how we return the list and everything. And uh, let's run the code. So uh, before we go there, I just want to mention that uh, since you guys have seen this video and seen this approach, I would recommend that after this video, you guys look at merged K sorted list problem. So instead of two, we are going to merge K number of uh, list and uh, there are multiple approaches so we'll go through all the approaches so i highly recommend since you guys are looking at this video uh, after this you look at that problem okay so this is our uh, final code this is java code we also have c sharp code over here so feel free to use whichever version you guys like so the while loop is pretty much similar to what we discussed on the whiteboard the only thing i can mention over here is uh, we're creating a dummy node called node and then we are pointing head to it so what will happen is we'll have dummy node and then the merge list would be after that. So once while loop is done, 
what we do is we return head dot next. So that's our start of the merge list. So there you go. Uh, that's the complete gist of it. Pretty simple. So let's run it. Let's make sure everything is ex as expected. And then uh, I also have one more test case just to make sure uh, we see the valid output for that as well. Uh, so there you go. Uh, that's all it is. Uh, so I hope you guys learned something new. And if you like the video, then give me thumbs up. Uh, let me know your feedback, suggestion, and comments. And then subscribe to the channel for more videos. Thank you.